Hey guys, how's it going? Hope you guys are doing well as always and I'm back with another pack opening video and sorry I'm a little bit late just because I've been really busy with work and stuff, you know, same as usual. And for this video, we are going to be open a total of 100 packs and this set is going to be set number 11 and if you notice, the next set is going to be set Chell and set Chell contain a new clan which is going to be Link Joker and I'm pretty sure most of us are looking forward to that because we have no clue how Locke is going to affect this game. And yeah, I can't wait for Link Joker just below a month time for it to come out. So patient guys, patient. But in the meantime, we have support for 4 different clans which is going to be Narukami, Kagero, Aqua Force and Genesis. So without further ado, let's start cracking some packs. Okay, so as you can see, I have a total of 140 pack tickets. But I'm just gonna be using a hundred of them just because I want to save the rest for the next set. Since if you want to build a new clan from scratch, you need to have a good amount of packs saved up, and of course you need to have good luck as well. And I do plan to fully complete my Link Joker deck the moment it got released. At least that's the plan. But you know, plan don't always go as you expected it to be. So yeah, for this time I'm just gonna be opening a hundred. So let's start cracking. So I honestly think that Genesis might be the best support in this set, but it's just my opinion. And of course we have a sparkling system right now, which is the SP medal event like the previous one. So you can exchange a 100 medal for a SP triple rare of your choice in this set. So of course, one pack equals one medal, so we need to open 100 pack to actually exchange for a SP triple rare. Okay, we got the new PG for Seal Dragon. So I don't really know what I want to build in this set, so it depends what I pull, I will just build what I pull pretty much. But I do want to try to build Genesis, honestly. Okay, another Seal Dragon. Okay, look like we are not going to get any Triple Rare in the first 10 pack, which is fine. We still have 90 more packs to go. Can we get one more Double Rare at least? Okay, we did and it's an SP Seal Dragon PG, which is pretty good. So. 3 double in our first 10 pack, not the greatest, but hey, no complaints man, no complaints. You just need to be grateful for what you are given, and you know, your luck might just change later on. So honestly, I'm not a huge fan of the SP metal gacha sparkling system thing. I run the regular one because the regular one you can exchange for a triple just for 50 medals. But I guess for people that want to fully max out their rarity deck, the SP sparkling system is great for them. Okay, no guarantee triple rare again, sadly. But finger crossed, let's hope we can get a triple rare regardless. Okay, that looks like a Narukami one, but I don't think that's that great of a double rare, so just gonna ignore that. And to me, Narukami we see the least support in this set because there's only one new triple rare for Narukami okay no sign of triple rare yet okay oh two double rare okay i will take the pg for aqua force Ooh, two Double rare, one SP, and that looked like Narukami to me. Ooh, another SP Seal Dragon PG, what? Okay, interesting. So, this 10 pack we got a total of 7 double rare, which is pretty cool, 2 SP. Still no triple rare, come on, come on, it's about time you show yourself. It's about time, my friend. Because I really do not want to open more than 100 pack. I really do need to save for set 12. And of course, if you guys want to play Link Joker, you guys should save as well. Oh my god, no guaranteed triple rare again. That's pretty sad to see. Okay, another PG for Aqua Force. I mean, I guess if you don't want to give me a triple rare, I will just take a bunch of double rare. 
it's still pretty good in my opinion. And of course, I would love to see a shooting star animation soon. 30 packs in and no spread is pretty deadly. Okay, no sign of any new double rare. Okay, this 10 pack is pretty shitty if you ask me. One double rare for 10 packs. That is incredibly bad. Jesus Christ. Okay, number 40 pack. I need you to give me two cheaper red, please. 30 packs in and not a single cheaper red, so bad. Of course, I do wish you guys the best of luck when you guys open your pack. Can I get a guaranteed cheaper red animation? Okay, it's about time. So like I say, I do hope to get two because 40 pack for one cheaper red is still pretty bad in my opinion. Oh my god, an SP. Triple Red, which is gonna be Sweet Command Dragon, and in my opinion, this is the Triple Red that is the weakest in this set because the skill isn't that great. As you don't really need to run this in your current Eradicator build, I feel like your original Erad Eradicator build is still better. You still run your Bowing Sword Dragon, your Descendant, and Gunner Buster, but you might be able to replace your Gunner Buster with him. So it's totally up to you. So let's move on. Since we get a Triple Red in our first 10 packs, not 10 pack, in our first pack. There's a chance that we get another triple rare. You know what? I'm not gonna click one by one just because I get my triple rare already. Oh, two double rare. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Oh, more double rare. And that's the new Genesis break, right? Okay, I keep getting this guy. I think I have a place out of it already. I mean, we can check later on. I mean, we can check right now, to be honest. Let's see. Yeah, we do have a place out of it already, as you can see. One of it convert into material. And I guess it's a pretty alright temp pack. We can't really complain about SP Triple to be honest. Just a little bit disappointed that it's not the Triple Red that I wanted. Alright guys, 60 more packs to go. I don't think we can complete any decks, but the good news is I can craft 3 triple rare for each of the 4 clan in this set. Okay, no guaranteed triple rare yet again. A SP double rare, that's pretty cool. Oh, that is the Seal Dragon Brick, right? Which I don't think is needed, to be honest, in your block cage deck. Because Kaigiro actually have 3 triple in this set and there's 2 break right and I prefer the other break right which is Thunder's Dry Dragon so I guess we can move on from here Oh my god we just got another triple rare that's oh my god that's the first time I got a double shooting star animation on a single pack that's insane that is insane guys oh my god what did I just say don't complain and your luck might change. Okay, more of you guys. Okay. Okay, let's start from the left. Fortuna, that is a good triple rare, which I won. And a Dallas Drive Dragon, which I just mentioned. Wow, this pack is nuts. So like I mentioned just now, Dallas Drive Dragon is another break right, which I prefer. Since I personally think it's stronger since it is a restander, you can pair with your Block Hitch Inferno, any great tree. You can play with your DN also, and you can stand a total of two times, and that is three attacks, which is nuts. And Fortuna, which is another good card from Genesis because of her effect, you can guarantee to twin drive double trigger. And there's also a chance to get a triple trigger. So that is really nuts in my opinion. Alright, let's move on. I can't believe this just happened. A double shooting star animation, Jesus Christ. And I do not know why I keep getting this 
double rare. I think that's like seven copy or six. I have no clue. Pretty sure it's seven though. Okay, look like our luck have turned around. Oh my god, is this happening? Is this happening? Four triple rare in seven packs. This is nuts. This is nuts. This is why I love shooting stars so much. Let's see, what's it gonna be? Another Dunless Drive Dragon. Let's go. I would take it, man. I would love a playset of it. But I still have no clue how I want to build Dunless Drive because you can pair with your block cage or even your DN. There's so many ways to build it. Well, this set of packs are insane. And another Seal Dragon PG, which I think I have a playset of already. Okay, I need to screenshot this, man. This is crazy. 4 triple and 10 packs. Wow. Okay, I'm starting to feel really good right now. We still have 50 more packs, I believe. Okay, no guarantee triple, which is fine. You never know when the shooting star will appear. So like usual, I'm just gonna hope for a bunch of double rare because I can craft triple rare, no problem. But I just want a bunch of double rare as well. Okay, that's a good double rare. We might need to play four of her. Not too sure yet. Okay, 2 double rare and that is the Reaper with 2 I think for Aqua Force and that's double rare, that's interesting. I have no clue that's a double rare. And if you play Reaper, you will probably need 4 copies of him. Not too sure. Okay, 5 double rare in 10 pack. Not the worst since we did get a double rare in 10 pack. Okay, 40 more packs to go guys, 40 more packs to go. Can we get any other triple rare besides those that we have already pulled? Okay, a guaranteed triple rare animation. Love to see that. And is that my second one? I think it's my second guaranteed triple rare animation. Okay, another double rare. For Aqua Force. Cool. Okay, no sign of our triple rare just yet, so got a feeling we are gonna get it soon and we got a fortune now which is really good because to be honest this is the triple rare that I want the most and because I got two copy of her already that means I can probably build a fortune deck since I can craft three triple rare from the Genesis side. So pretty happy about that. And Genesis have two new triple rare. And I'm glad that I didn't get the other one. Although the other one is good as well, but in my opinion, it's not as good as Fortuna. Okay, so that's it. Not too shabby. We got a triple rare that we wanted. Okay, 30 more packs to go. 30 more packs. Let's hope to get at least two triple rare. How about that? Two triple rare and 30 packs. I don't think that's asking for too much, honestly. Come on, can we get a guaranteed triple rare animation? And we did, let's go! Okay, I'm hoping to get a triple rare that I have not get before and we got Blockage Inferno, which is really good. And for those people that don't know what this card is, which is pretty much a Blockage Cross, right? And if you're playing to build a seal dragon deck you obviously need to play four copy of him because it's gonna be your main right and your win condition 
I believe, since it can retire all your opponent grade 2, and by doing so, you can push for 3 or more damage in a single turn, which is pretty good in my opinion. Okay. Oh my god, Shooting Star. Bless you, Shooting Star. You are so amazing today. Okay, let's see. What's it gonna be? I'm hoping for Alpha Force Triple S since we have not get any. Oh my god, the SP Triple Rare. That's our second SP Triple Rare, and this is the other Genesis Triple Rare that I'm talking about. And honestly, I don't think it's that bad of a card. I like the third skill, which is every time your Rear Guard got retired or when you use your Sentinel to guard, instead of going to the drop zone, you go into the soul. And because of this skill, you can charge your soul pretty quickly, in my opinion. So honestly, not a bad card. So pretty happy about this pool, and it's SP as well, that's insane. How do we just get two Triple Rare? SP in a hundred packs. That don't usually happen, honestly. I have no clue if I have pulled all the double rares already. Because I feel like I'm still missing some. Because usually hundred packs won't give you all the double rares you need. Especially if you need a playset of it. Oh my god. Oh my god, a third triple rare in our 10 packs, are you kidding me? Okay, let's see, what's it gonna be? Is it gonna be an Alpha Force triple rare? Come on! It is another blockage inferno. Okay, our Kaigyo is looking pretty awesome. We have a total of 5 new triple rare from Kaigyo, that's nuts. That is nuts. How do we just pull 3 triple rare? We pull 4 triple rare in 10 packs and then we pull 3 triple rare in another 10 packs. That's insane. Our luck is insane. Wow. You no, know, to be honest, because of our first 30 packs, I didn't expect this opening to be so insane. But I'm glad it is. I'm really glad it is. And since I said our goal is 3 triple rare, it's actually 2 triple rare in 30 packs. I don't think I should ask for any more triple rare to be honest. So I'll just be grateful for what I'm given. I'm just hoping for a bunch of double rare at the moment right now. And this is our last 20 pack. So after this, last 10 pack, and then we're gonna do a quick recap before we close up the video. And that's an SP break, right? That's cool. Ooh, another SP. Seal Dragon Grade 2. Oh my god, we are getting so many SP. That's insane. How are we getting so many SP? Okay, one more pack. Is there gonna be anything? Nope. Which is fine. Um, two double rare, but both of the double rare are SP, so that's pretty cool in my opinion. So, last 10 pack before we sign off this video. Is it gonna contain a triple rare? Let's find out. And sadly, we did not pull any triple rare from the upper force section. Pretty sad, pretty sad. Okay, a blue circle, that's totally fine. As usual, if you guys watch my pack opening video, there's always a set of 10 packs that contain a blue circle, so no surprise there. But I'm just disappointed that we are going to end off the video with nothing. Just hoping for double rare. Come on. Are we now going to get a single double rare? But even if that's the case, we still can't complain. We got so many triple red and so many SPs. Okay, look like this is really gonna be a dark 10 packs. Okay, worst 10 pack of the history. In set 11, at least for me. So 10 packs and not a single double rare or triple rare or rares, but no complaints. Hey, we got so many good stuff already. So before I sign off this video, let's do a quick recap. Okay, so let's see how many triple rare we pull in total first. Um, let's take a look at Kaigero first. So 
so we pull a total of five triple red from Kaigiro side. That's cool. Let's take a look at Narukami. Narukami we pull one and it's SP, so that's a total of six triple red. Genesis we pull three triple red, one SP. That's a total of nine triple red. And I guess that's it since we didn't pull any triple red from Aqua Force section. So a total of nine triple red in a hundred packs. Honestly, it's a little bit below average because you do want to get one triple red every 10 pack you open. So the ideal amount of triple red that I want is 10. But since two of them are SP and we did get a bunch of SP double red as well, so I don't think I can complain. Yeah, so I guess this should be it. So same as always, thank you guys for watching and I do hope you guys enjoy the video like always. And of course, leave a comment down below letting me know what you guys pull in your pack, be it your, the English server or the Japan server. And yeah, this should be it. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for next video. Good. Bye.